see here according to Hooke's law, we have done here this is stress is directly proportional to strain and this can be written stress is equal to proportionality constant k into strain and k is equal to stress upon strain and this k is known as proportional coefficient of elasticity or you can say proportionality constant or modulus of elasticity. So, there are three types of the modulus of elasticity. First one is that is called Young's modulus and that is represented by here y. Second one is here the bulk modulus and represented by capital B here and third one is here shear modulus and represented by capital G. So, now we will explain here one by one all these three types of modulus of elasticity. Now, see here Young's modulus. In this case, suppose you have taken this is the support to suspend a wire. Suppose you have got a wire like this having cross section area A and length is here L. Now, when you apply force F perpendicular to the area of cross section, so stress is developed that stress is known as tensile stress. Due to this stress, there is change in the length and this increase in the length is delta L. So, we can write here Young's modulus y is equal to normal stress that is actually tensile normal stress divided by longitudinal strain. So, here we can write y is equal to f upon a force upon area of cross section that is delta L upon L and we can write here f L upon a into delta L. Also, we can write here that is if the weight you are hanging. So, f can be written m into g L divided by pi r square r is the radius of cross section into delta L. So, this is the formula for the Young's modulus.